So post 1.0.3 patch, you can't actually farm Nightmare Dungeons. Well actually guys, yes you can. And today we'll explain exactly how you do this to earn infinite amounts of increased XP. Stay tuned. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so post 1.0.3 patch, they basically removed the ability to farm Nightmare Dungeons how we used to do it. But guys, today I bring you a new reset method. This will allow you to farm any Nightmare Dungeon of your choice infinite amounts of times to earn crazy amounts of XP. Now credit for this one goes to Jay Reezy on my Discord for hitting me up and explaining how to do this. It's quite straightforward, a little more long winded than previously, but we're still going to get it efficiently for you guys today. Okay, so firstly, post 1.0.3 patch, the way dungeons work now in regards to their XP has drastically changed. You earn way, way, way more. Someone calculated on PC where it can be upwards of three times more. This is great for us because we're going to be farming them. Now, what I will also say is it was believed before that dungeons, nightmare dungeons, where the enemies are three levels above you was the best way of doing things because it was about that perfect spot for our XP and efficiency. Now guys, the higher that Nightmare Dungeon is in regards to the enemy level against your level, if they're 10, 15 levels above you, you will earn more XP. So firstly, it's about finding that right level of Nightmare Sigil, that Nightmare Dungeon, where you can farm it efficiently. If it's 10, 15 levels above you, you want to do this because you will earn way more XP. If it's only 5 levels above you, that's fine too. But find that, you need to find that perfect spot. Then guys, you obviously want that perfect nightmare dungeon you want to farm. There's plenty out there which are great farms. I'll run you off a quick couple now. Onyx Hold, which is what I demonstrated this with. It's a great, great dungeon. No two which ways about it. Blind Burrows is great. Order's Cave is great. Uh, the Haunted Refuse is great. Demon's Wake is great. And Alderwood is also great ones. But there's many in this game, guys, that will give you increased XP. In fact, they all will either way. Obviously, some are way more efficient than others. Unfortunately, this does not work in a team, as far as I'm aware. So this is solo only. Okay, so to set this up, go ahead and activate that Nightmare Sigil. So whatever Nightmare Sigil you want to farm, whatever Nightmare Dungeon you do want to farm for that increased XP, go ahead and activate it. Once you've activated it guys, fast travel to said Nightmare Dungeon and simply enter it. Once you're inside the Nightmare Dungeon guys, you then want to exit the Nightmare Dungeon. Here guys, you want to head to any of our dungeon on the map. Doesn't matter which one it is, but you need to head to it. I personally and I highly recommend you go into the Iron Hold Dungeon because what we need to do is we need to complete the very first objective within said dungeon. The iron hold is super, super easy. You run up to one enemy, you kill said enemy, it's an elite, you grab the key, there it is, objective done. So the iron hold located right here on the map, right by a fast travel point as well, guys, I recommend you going to this one and using this one in the future, which I will explain. So yes, go here, guys, do what you gotta do, complete that first objective, then guys, exit the dungeon. Once you're outside this dungeon, fast travel to that nightmare dungeon you activated. In here, guys, you need to run it up until the last, well, you don't need to run it up until the last point, but you need to run it, just farm away, do what you gotta do, but there's one rule, do not complete it. Do not complete this dungeon. So if there's a boss you have to kill, do not kill the boss. If there's a certain objective you have to complete to complete the dungeon, do not complete that objective. From here, guys, now to farm it and reset this nightmare dungeon, you need to head to any other dungeon on the map again. Again guys, I recommend the iron hold because we have to do that first objective again. This is where it differs, we have to do that first objective again to reset the nightmare dungeon so all them ads, all them enemies respawn. Again, iron hold is perfect, you can do this in a little 30 seconds. So go to this fast travel point on the map guys, go to the iron hold, run to that elite, kill him, get the key, objective done. From here guys, you can exit the dungeon, then fast travel to that nightmare dungeon you have activated and you'll notice guys that all the enemies within here have reset, meaning you can farm it again. Now what I do believe is to farm the nightmare dungeon, you will have to at least complete the first objective in that said nightmare dungeon too. So 
run the nightmare dungeon well you're going to run it up until the end anyway if you're farming it either way but you just need to make sure you get past that first objective this isn't something i have tried and tested myself when i'm farming this onyx hold which you're seeing on screen now i normally run it way past the first objective either way so do not worry about that but yes again activate the nightmare seizure from your inventory go to said nightmare dungeon step inside walk out of it go to any other dungeon on the map again iron hold is perfect fast travel here go inside the iron hold kill that elite grab that key the first objective is done exit this dungeon head back to your nightmare dungeon and just run it up until the end but do not complete it to reset it leave the dungeon head back to the iron hold go to that elite grab that key objective done your nightmare dungeon will have reset go back to your nightmare dungeon guys and therefore you can farm it over and over and over again a simple simple way in resetting nightmare dungeons i mean it's not quite as efficient as what it was previously but it's still super super quick it's probably going to take you an extra 25 35 seconds if you're on next gen or pc to reset a said nightmare dungeon so it's definitely worth it in my opinion and again guys if you have the right nightmare schedule for the right nightmare dungeon you're going to earn tons and tons of xp doing this i mean loot wise it's going to be crazy too and you can if you have full inventories of loot you can obviously head to towns and sell them in between doing what you got to do to reset said dungeon so don't worry about that but this will earn you tons of xp and like i said since the 1.0.3 patch with the increased uh xp you get from enemies i mean obviously you get increased xp for completing nightmare dungeons but we ain't doing that here we ain't completing this we're just farming the enemies and luckily with the 1.0.3 patch they confirmed that the monsters within nightmare dungeons do give you increased xp gains which is what we want people it really is now what i will say is they nerfed the last method in doing this so this probably will get a nerf sooner or later too so if this is something you're interested in doing if you want to farm those nightmare dungeons over and over to earn crazy amounts of xp to level up super super quick i mean i'd use this while you can because it probably will get nerfed now with the right dungeon here you can earn well i mean pre-patch or some dungeons that could give players upwards of 10 15 million xp per hour post patch dungeon farming with increased xp gains this is going to substantially rise now i don't play on pc so i cannot calculate it i can't see my xp gains on my xp bar but for anybody who plays on pc i'm sure they will let you know down below again some great dungeons in this game you want to look out for Eldwood is absolutely amazing if you get the sigil for this perfect demon's wake is unreal forgetting runes is great i also love the haunted refuge orders cave iron hold i mean iron holds where we're resetting but it's still itself a great dungeon to farm if you have the sigil for it try that out you just have to use any other dungeon to reset this but yes guys you know what you gotta do here you know your xp farms you know your dungeons you know what suits you so do what you gotta do but there we have it guys guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one